skate in years. Um, I have to tell you though, I'm pretty impressed with I all the too. skills you're able to demonstrate. Thank you. My mom was a roller skater, and I roller skated for like uh, 30 years. I'm yes. okay. And so it took me a minute to get going, but you know, like you said, right? It's like riding a bike. Exactly. Yeah. So tell me when Atlanta Roller Derby got started. Sure, uh, 2004, I believe. Mm -hmm. yep. That's when uh, um, our founder, our founder Tanya Hyde. So we all have derby names. So our founder Tanya Hyde. Um, she was a visionary, and she got a bunch of girls together at a roller rink um, and started derby. Um, it was the modern iteration of derby started in 2001 in Austin, Texas, and then people started hearing about it. I believe Tanya had a friend in Texas and started telling her about it. So she started it here. So um, it's been going for a while. We're in our... Yeah, I think I started Bowdy in 2005. It's called Bowdy. Mm -hmm. Tell them what Bowdy is. is. A, a game is about. A game is about. Mm -hmm. And so it's two teams, and we're going to see a scrimmage a little later on. And you, what's the object of the game? Um, there, there are five skaters on the track from each team. Mm -hmm. um, one skater is called the Jammer. She was a star cover on her helmet. She's the only one who scores points. And she scores points for every opposing blocker that she passes. Okay. So one of the complicated things about Derby, and it also makes it really fun to watch, is that people are playing offense and defense at the same time. So that's when all the hitting comes in yeah. and the blocking. Mm -hmm. Exactly. I used to watch the roller derby back in the 70s. Yes, I'm that old. And so um, <laughs> I remember, and they used to flip over the rails. I thought that was so exciting. You always hit the big girl. So I could be that blocker for you guys. Right? Absolutely. Yes. I'm like, oh. you, you got some good skating skills. Thank too. you. Thank you. Could.